Tirani has departed on her journey along the dark path of the Empyrean from Rena's rise, as she calls it. Now Lady Rani is in your hands. I pray that you serve her well unto the very end. Or is it merely thy habit to talk to dolls? Fine. Fine. I hadn't expected any soul to recognize me in this guise. But now the cat is out the bag. I cannot allow thee thy freedoms. Perform for me a service as recompense. Eliminate the baleful shadows which prowl these lands. The name of Rani the Witch is already sullied by thee. I will not brook disobedience in this matter. Let us speak of the past a while. I was once an Empyrean of the demigods. Only I, Mikola, and Melania could claim that title. Each of us was chosen by our own two fingers as a candidate to succeed Queen Marika, to become the new god of the coming age, which is when I received Blythe, in the form of a vassal tailored for an Empyrean. But I would not acquiesce to the two fingers. I stole the rune of death, slew mine own Empyrean flesh, casting it away. I would not be controlled by that thing. The Two Fingers and I have been cursing each other ever since, and the Baleful Shadows are their assassins. Even when I turned my back upon the Two Fingers, Blythe remained my loyal ally. <laughs> Though he was created a vassal for an Aryan, he was a colossal failure on the part of the Two Fingers, Blythe and E.G. both. Art willing to give too much to me, yet they both understand what lieth beyond the dark path, that I must betray everything and rid the world of what came before. Ah, should I add thee to the list, another one, kind of heart, as kind of heart as they? Oh, Shadow. Thou art the last. Tell the two fingers that Rani the Witch cometh to rend thy flesh with a fateful wound, ne'er to heal. more of a challenge than I envisioned. Now I can finally stand before them. This is farewell, my dear. Tell Blythe and E.G. I love them.